um, what we're going to do now is just going to have a, a bit of a walk around our setup. Um, we're here at Jerusalem Creek Campground number two. And uh, yeah, come with us, we'll have a look around our camp setup. So we've got the, the old GU Nissan Patrol. Um, hopefully we might update that shortly, which um, I've had that for 21 years, been a fantastic car. But um, yeah, it might be time to do an upgrade. And we've got the King's awning and wing. And we've also got the King's Big Daddy Deluxe. Um, sort of wanted to do everything on a budget. Um, can't really fault the King stuff, it's really good. Um, yeah, and then we've got the ground mat here. We've got the little fire. Um, we've got a couple of different cookers here. We've got a gas one and a butane one. Um, just depending on what we're going to do. Uh, inside the swag. Let's just zip that up. We've got the, I don't know if you can see in there, we've got the King's sleeping bags. Which are really comfy. One of the best sleeping bags I've ever slept in. And then if you come around here. And we've got our shower tent set up. You can have a shower. I've got the 160 watt solar panel which is foldable and then in the back um, I've got the King 60 litre fridge freezer which is um, yeah it's been fantastic had it for about three years now and it hasn't missed a beat um, I've just got all my connections here um, which is going to show us our voltage and if you can see that on the camera, I've got some King's um, LED lights plugged in as well, for camping lights. Um, dual batteries just in the back there, um, being charged at the moment from the solar. I've got a, um, yeah, a small inverter. I really don't need an inverter for much. Most of my stuff is USB charge. Um, it's only really power tools and stuff like that that I'll charge off that. Um, got the King's Titan drawers, um, which I've actually made a this slidable um, slidable chopping board. Slides up and back on it. It's a bit messy at the moment because we are camping, and we just have things like our salt and pepper, coffee, sugar, um, cutlery in a box in there. We've got other pots and pans, tea towels. Uh, what have we got in the front here? Well, I've got one of the plastic storage units. I've got cards, band-aids, um, yeah, insect repellent, garbage bags, um, just all the things we need for camping go in there. And then um, get those out of the way so they don't jam in. And then in this side one, we've got all my tools, just recovery gear. Um, yeah, um, yeah, a bag of tools, just basic stuff, tape, jack, a um, bit of sticky tape, um, my compressor leads, and yeah, I don't know, just things you might need when you might need to do some mechanic work while you're out and about. And this side here, I've um, got a little compressor, pump up the tyres, and I've also got a 20 litre water jug here that I've uh, rigged up. Um, you can see people put these together online just with some parts from Bunnings or wherever you want to get them from um, Yeah, it's just got a it's just a tap You can fill it from here, and then you can also pour the water out from here So that's um, quite handy 20 liters of water always good to bring water when you go away And we've got the other Kings awning on the back you got a reverse body and um, Yeah, that's pretty much our setup um we sort of we're quite comfortable doing it and um, maybe when we get the new car um, which is closer to the end of the year we will start setting it up again uh, maybe with some higher quality gear but um, as I said the King stuff has been pretty good I can't really fold it for the price and um, yeah it's got us through a few uh, few uh, camp expeditions so um yeah also up here i'll just show this we've got the um the led uh strip lighting we can turn that on and off for the dimmer there at night so that's just 
also running off the 12 volt system at the back um, yeah but that's pretty much the setup um, if you want to ask any questions about it what you know you might want to ask what what the awnings like or what how the fridge works or whatever like that just um, yeah send us a message and um, we'll get back to you as soon as we can anyway I hope you enjoy this walk around of the uh, the GU setup and, um... <laughs> Jerusalem Creek, uh, camp number two, and the weather's been absolutely awesome. Tess for the last, for the last three days, <laughs> it has been beautiful. No wind at all. No rain. No rain. And um, yeah, perfect camping weather. So it's just beautiful. Um, yeah, so we're all packed up. We're ready to hit the road. So um, we hope you enjoy this episode. And and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the like button. And hit the notification bell Correct. so you'll get notified with our upcoming videos. We'll see you on the next episode of The Bite with Craig and Tess. Bye. Bye.